we predict that this is going to be a this episode is going to be a fan fave. We hope. <clears throat> Marcus books me on a gay cruise. Of course, I'm thrilled because gay men love me. They get me, and as soon as I get to the ship, I start noticing all the women. Hey, Deb! Oh my God! And I run into Margaret Cho. I thought this was a gay cruise. It is. Lesbians. And Deborah loses it. Lesbians don't like me. Mm. They don't like me. They're crawling all over this boat. It's not a boat, it's a ship. See? Deborah's dying a thousand deaths. It's incredible. But then it kind of turns around and they seem to like her and think she's kind of charming and hot and funny. And <laughs> so now she's like, woo! Hey, girls. Hey. I can't believe how wrong I was. I mean, I should have embraced lesbians years ago. They love women, and I'm a fabulous one. I mean, it just makes perfect sense. The scene Jean sang in that piano bar was such a fun scene to shoot. She's so amazing, and our extras were amazing. The crowd was so into it. A couple people had tears in their eyes. <laughs> Jean is just so joyful and happy singing like that. It was really, really cool. She's wearing the most incredible outfit in that episode. She's doing some cruise wear, which <laughs> I think she enjoyed. Kathleen Felix Hager, our costume designer, just does such an incredible job with everything Jean wears. Deborah Vance does cruise wear very well. Have you ever considered being with a woman? The idea of gender and sexuality is obviously at the forefront of mostly every conversation Ava has. So it's not exactly a new topic for her or for them. Come on. I like men. So no, I've never considered it. It is a, a quiet moment where Deborah is, is really willing to listen. Have you ever considered like why you like men? I don't understand that question. In my day, there were two options. You liked one or you liked the other. I mean, why do some people like jazz? Some people like classical. You just like what you like. We loved that scene because they have very different points of view about gender and sexuality and orientation. Not every queer person feels like they arrive into existence with an attraction to like a specific kind of person, and that's okay too. Neither of them were sort of in the right or in the wrong. It was a conversation. Your sexuality isn't a choice, but whether or not you examine it, I think, is. And it was something that I don't think we see every day on TV, and so it felt really good to explore that in a very real way. Deborah was rather close-minded about those kinds of things, but now instead of being just close-minded and judgmental, I think now she's just a little bit more, don't totally get it, but I never thought of it that way. Yeah. So maybe the evolution is in Deborah's sort of patience. Yeah, yeah, and then she meets this very attractive woman on the cruise ship who seems to be kind of flirting with her. Seriously, you're just so oh. amazing in oh. everything that you do. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Hey now.